Alrighty, welcome back everyone. Welcome back to some Death Stranding. Oh, some people have been, uh, using my roads, paths, adding materials. I got three likes. Three whole likes. Wow. Right, anyway, we've got an antimatter bomb to deliver. Yay! This is going to go so badly. Where am I delivering it to? Oh yeah, the paleontologist. The dinosaur. Man, is this going to be Ross Geller? He's the only paleontologist I know. And I don't know him personally because he's uh, he's a fictional character in uh, a very popular sitcom from the 90s slash early 2000s. Anyway, I need a, a quick sip of my water before we begin. Sorry again for the wait between videos, um, but hey. Hmm. This video is uh, is actually sponsored by uh, Evian uh, Natural Mineral Water. No, it's not. It's not sponsored. It's fine, though. We're going to just crack on today. Right. Let's plot a route. Oh, actually, shit. Before I do that, I think what I want to do is make some container repair. Uh, repair. Repair spray. Repair spay. Uh, because our antimatter bomb container ain't looking too good right now. It's taken about nearly half damage, thanks to all this frickin' time snow. So, we're going to fabricate some more spray. Uh, yes. Just the one, I think, will be fine. We'll use up some of it now. And then, uh, then we'll be on our way. So, let's go. Carry that on our back for now, that's fine. Ah, right. Let's do that straight away. Uh, point backwards. Yeah. Don't want that antimatter bomb getting exposed to the elements. Even though it already looks like it is. But that's okay. Right. Plot route time. So... We have a few bridges, luckily, that people have built. Uh, no zip lines, which is a shame. We could build some on the way, though, if we wanted to. I have a few PCCs on me. Uh, looks like it's going to be pretty tough terrain, though. So we're going to head to the first bridge, then we'll head over to the second bridge. Hopefully there won't be any BTs. I'm not seeing any BT markers anywhere near. So, fingers crossed. And then, uh, then onwards to the paleontologist. Let's see how this goes. Right. In fact, let's, um... Which PCC is it that's damaged? I think it's this one. This one's pretty close to being broken, so I'm just going to use it straight away. I'm going to plonk it somewhere here. I don't know if this is going to benefit anyone. No can do, Sam. Okay. Can't be built that close I together. know. Give me a break. To settle for a different spot outside the sensor I range. will do. I'm going to cross this bridge and then I'm going to plonk it down, alright? Look at this bridge. This bridge has got 152,000 likes. It is a pretty good bridge, though. That, I mean, that is genuinely a decent bridge. I will accept this bridge. I will... Oh, there is a zip line there. Hang on a minute. Why can't I see that on my map? That is a zip line, right? That totally looks like a zip line to me. Oh, that's a sign for a zip line. But it should be like there? That is a zip line, right? Isn't it? I don't know. We're gonna. We're going to build a zip line somewhere. Right. Uh, yeah, in fact, yeah, let's go over this way. Follow the routes that I've plotted down. Uh, go, go be careful, by the way, guys. We do have a very, very, very unstable bomb. It's very easy to forget, actually, what you're carrying. So, let's... Uh, Let's not do that. Right, yeah. I kind of want to see if the zip line can be linked up to anything. Uh, in fact, 
Oh, let me unequip that. No, what are you doing? Yeah, let's get up, get up to some higher ground and then see if we can get a lay of the land. It's actually uh, pissing it down outside my window right now. I don't know if you can hear it. It woke me up uh, very early in the in the morning with like it must have been hail. It absolutely battered the side of the house and the window. It was very loud. Yeah, why isn't that zip line popping up on my freaking map? Is it? Why isn't that showing up? That is so odd. Hmm. Well, whatever. Ah, will it show up now that I've scanned it? Oh, right, okay then. So they don't all appear. You've got to sometimes scan for them. I see. I see. Right, well, let's uh, crack on towards that bridge. Let's cross that one. We'll cross that bridge when we come to it, which is very soon. Uh, uh, and then we will we will plonk down a, a zipline. Because this PCC that I have is going to be damaged very soon. And then we won't be able to use it. Dum -de -dum. A very weird place to put a zipline. Okay. God, that scared me then. Freaking bridge terminal. Wasn't expecting that. Right. Still got a ways to go. Still got a ways to go. Which is that way, I think. Is it? Yeah. I'm going to put a zipline at the very tippity top up here. Just because I can. And it will connect to that other one. Not that you really need it to, but hey, it's something. And I'm going to plonk it on the very edge. So that any ones I build down below... My all-terrain skeleton's all, all, almost ruined. Are you freaking serious? Alright, that'll do. So how the frick do I get down here now? How the bloody hell do I get down here in one piece? More importantly, how do I get down there with the bomb being in one piece? I think I should have brought some climbing anchors. Uh, I might have to go back and grab them. I might have to go back and grab some climbing anchors, because that is not good. I have to go down there. And I don't know if there's going to be a better route down. Like, it just looks horrific all the way around. So what I might have to do, guys, is quickly nip back to, uh, to the place. And... Uh, pick up some climbing anchors, so I will be right back. Okay, chaps, so what I've had to do, I've come back, I've grabbed some more repair spray, because the bomb container is taking so much damage up here so quickly. I'm going to rest under this time fall shelter. I'm going to hope... I mean, that repairs things as well, by the way, so if you want to save on repair spray, definitely uh, get under a time fall shelter. I'm going to rest... And also, I just realized my stamina's really low. Uh, so I'm gonna... Yeah, take a quick swig of me drink. Uh, I could actually just rest under here and probably get some stuff back. Container damaged metals? What are you talking about, game? Let's pass some time. Uh, I, I just don't think... The weather has not cleared. I don't think the weather is going to clear under uh, under these sort of uh, conditions. We're being so high up in the mountains. I I could be wrong. We might as well try. Uh, but I've grabbed some climbing anchors. I've got like four of them. Which is why my weight is pretty high right now. So, uh, And I did build a, another zipline. So, yeah, we're just going to see how this goes. The weather has not cleared. I'm going to try one more time. But, yeah, when you pass time like this, things do t deteriorate elsewhere in the world. So, yeah, weather has not cleared. 
What a surprise. Right. Let's, uh... Let's just freaking do this. I'm gonna just do a quick save before I set off. So, I've got my repair spray. Uh, I've got my climbing anchors. I actually got a new all-terrain skeleton as well, so it should be in perfect condition. Uh, not for very long, but, you know, our other one was about to be completely destroyed. And I think we do need it for these uh, kind of... these kinds of treks. So, here we go again. <laughs> Attempt number two. Let's hopefully see if we can get a bit further this time. Uh, but yeah, I, I didn't realize... I, I mean, we repaired the antimatter bomb, and I came back, and I checked it, and it was like at 80% damage. And I'm like, dude, that's insane. We need to get out of these freaking blizzards, like ASAP. As soon, no, ASAP, ASAP, as soon as fucking possible. As you can see, I did build another zipline here just to kind of make things a little bit quicker. And the less time you spend on the ground, the better. Uh, yeah. And then we'll uh, we'll do some abseiling down the side of a mountain with a you know antimatter bomb on my back. It's no big deal. Norman does this uh, does this kind of thing for fun. I'm sure. Probably in real life. I can see Norman Reedus doing this in real life. Because he's awesome. There we go. Uh, when he's not riding his bike or killing zombies, that is. Okay. Let's... Diggity do this. Use the zipline. Use the zipline. Now, we're not going to... That... Oh, hang on. Uh... Yes, that one. We Fuck your bridge! My zipline's much better. Yay! Give me likes. Give me likes, game, please. People. People of the world. Death Stranding us. Give me likes. Right. This is where the fun begins, as Anakin Skywalker once said. It's time... to climb... downwards. At a very brisk pace. So, uh, wait a minute. Am I going the right way here? All right, that way. Okay. Wish me luck, guys. I'm going to need it. Hopefully, woo. Watch your weight, Mr. Balancy Norman. I don't, don't ask. Right. Let's plunk it somewhere where I believe we're going to get the most use out of it. Oh, that just looks horrendously... I don't even know if we're going to be... Ooh. Is this even going to be long enough? I know we've got several. We can use them if we can stop off at various ledges on the way down. <laughs> Norman, what are you doing? You've got a big bomb on your back. Right. Let's... See how this goes. I just want to get down there. Right. Here we go. Delivery bot has completed an order. Wonderful. Cool. I can keep on going, keep on going, keep on going. Yeah, 30 meters is quite a big... It's quite long, isn't it? 30 meters. Uh, I reckon I can plonk one down here. Or maybe just... On this little ledge. I've only got eight meters left. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. We're just gonna build a, a nice old route for everyone. In sufficient space, my ass. So hopefully people get good use out of this. There's no fuck has done anything for me around here. Apart from a couple of bridges. That is a long way down, man. Am I even going to be able to get down here to another ledge? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Um, 
That's not good. Hang on, hang on. I'll have to stop off a bit higher up. That's okay. We can hopefully put one down here. Yeah, that, that's looking more viable. That's looking more viable. It's a good job I did make so many. I didn't realize this was such a steep freaking precipice. Right, let's make another one. Oh, please tell me I can build it here. Thank you. We're going to get down this, this mountain. One way or another. Ah, that's a nice little ledge below us. That'll do nicely. I do believe. And then again, we could probably go a bit further down. I don't know, could we? Ugh, this is this is a little bit sketchy. I don't think I'm gonna build I don't think I can build something on this. Could I? Could I do it right on here, maybe? I don't know if there's going to be enough space there. So again, I'm going to go back up and hope to God we can plonk one down here. Just don't release the rope. I'm, I'm terrified of releasing the rope and falling backwards. My power gloves are nearly fucked. Dude. Come on. Oh, I saw it. I saw it. I could plonk something there then. I saw it. In fact, we could mosey on over here, couldn't we? Come on. Come on, let me build something here. Yes. Right, we're nearly, we're nearly down now. I reckon we'd only need one more at the top. Maximum, one more. Container damaged antimatter bomb. That's not good. But we have the repair spray. We have the repair spray, guys. Don't panic just yet. You leave that to me. Right, we're down. We're down. Sort of. Oh, not quite. That, that's okay, release the rope. I do believe we have one more we can use. Uh, actually, before I do that, let's actually repair the bomb. How much condition does it have? Ugh, see what I mean? It gets damaged so fucking fast. Like, holy crap. This time fall up in the mountains ain't no joke. I'm gonna use the, oh, all this spray, I think. But we're nearly there. We're nearly where we need to be anyway, so... Again. Now's not the time for fear. That comes later. There we go. And on the plus side, if I do need to get back up here, I have a route. I hope someone stumbles across my climbing anchors and goes, You know what? That dude who put down all these climbing anchors and made a nice safe route down this mountain, I'm going to give him like a billion likes. Because he seems like such a nice guy. And I am. Oh, we got a, an email from the geologist. I have not been checking my emails, have I? All my interviews. Right, I've got an itchy dose. Ugh, itchy dose. Uh, gross. Uh, right. Hmm. You know what? We're still kind of a ways away. But someone's put some ladders down. Uh, la uh, climbing anchors. I think that might be the paleontologist doing that. I don't think they're online ones, no. Okay, well, we've got uh, an online generator there. Hmm. Yeah, let's just uh, get back on course. It's that way, isn't it? Yeah. Right, well, we made it. We made it down. All right, we got some more music. Cool, cool, cool. I would have loved a time fall shelter down here, to be honest. I just don't build enough of that stuff, do I? I do rely heavily on other people's. Well, that's okay. This looks like a nice little uh, path. Makes me wonder how they how they designed the world of this, and how did they did they plan certain routes to be taken, or did they just kind of plonk things down willy nilly and say just figure it out? 
Nah, they must have planned a lot of this. Okay. It's very nice, relaxing music when you're carrying a massive... Displo uh, ...displosive! Explosive device, which is now referred to as a displosive. Ah, we're nearly there, we're nearly there. I'm making up all the words recently. Paralysized? That's another word I made up lately. Thought it was pretty good. Uh, here we go! Hey, that wasn't too bad! Stamina restored. Yeah, I think, uh, I think I'm gonna be resting up if I can. Right, I hope you like this bomb. I hope you put it to good use. Get at those fossils or whatever the thing you're after. Oh, it's such a relief when you get something like that to your destination. Oh. Right, time for a drink. Evian mineral water, no. Delivering cargo. Much appreciated, friend. Thanks to you, we can finally move ahead with the dig. I swear, this place is bad enough without having to worry about getting asphyxiated. <laughs> Not that I need to tell you. <laughs> you did it after all, though I can't for the life of me imagine how. It was difficult. It was difficult. Give me all the likes. Yes. The route I took was pretty shite. Kept going backwards and forwards. So, yeah. But still got an S rank. Yeah, it's never, it never quite gets to three star, does it? When you first go. Uh, right, let's get our bots back as well. The mountain, mountain spring water. Who's a good little bot? C rank. Okay. Ooh, we're nearly gr uh, grade 200. We are grade 200. Sweet. Two hundred and one. You can set up the chiral network while I work. Good. Oh, pumped porter. I must have. Uh... Oh, that must be for delivering so much weight in in uh, cargo. Okay, trophies. I like my trophies. Oh, don't cry, Norman. Frosty Norman. You look freezing, mate. You need a hot bath. That's a big chunk of uh, area back online. Cool, cool, cool. Paleontologist has joined the UCA. He looks nothing like Ross Geller. Oh, oxygen mask. Hey, hey. Oh, thematic grenade, whatever. Interview with a paleontologist. Dude, oxygen mask. Now that sounds pretty nice. Anyway, as it turns out, Sam Bridges, I have a favor to ask. Of course. A local reporter was on his way here with something very valuable, but dropped it on route. It's a 200 million year old ammonite, which looks, he says, almost as if it were still alive. He apparently stumbled across it in a boulder field, which had previously been hidden beneath a glacier, but. That's not the half of it. The man claims this ammonite has an umbilical cord. Ooh. An umbilical cord. Color me skeptical, but the specimen merits study, and I wasn't about to leave such delicate work to an amateur. So I asked him to carve out the whole surrounding chunk of rock and bring it here to me. Naturally, I wanted to compare it with contemporary specimens in the vicinity, which is why I had him excavate a number of those in addition to the one he told me about. But... What does a dumb fuck go and do? He loses the whole shipment. Didn't even have the good sense to mark which container had the ammonite with the umbilical cord. The cargo was supposedly lost in the area to the southwest, where toxic gases have a tendency to build ah. up. Ah. Ole 
Mr. Reliable claims his cargo scanner is broken, and there's no way he can recover the shipment. But you... you could track it down. To protect you against the fumes, I'll provide you with an oxygen mask. Just to be safe. Yeah. You can pick it up when you accept the order. Okay. That fossil could represent an epical discovery. While there are examples of viviparous fish, an ammonite with an umbilical cord is unheard of. And if it is indeed 200 million years old, it would also correspond with the end Triassic extinction, another one of the big five. Could the umbilical cord be connected to the beach? We must recover that cargo at all costs. It could provide a vital clue to the mechanisms underpinning the Death Stranding. We're so close. So very, very close to grasping the true nature of the phenomenon. Hurry, Sam. We cannot risk that ammonite being lost. Okay. 200 million years old. New order That's older than me, Mum. Holy crap. Right. Well, oxygen mask sounds great, doesn't it? But... Is there a way... I, I would very much... Like to take a bit of a rest first. An oxygen mask, huh? Good idea. Yeah. It'll filtrate the air and keep you breathing normally. In addition to protecting you from toxic gases, it'll also help to reduce fatigue from strenuous activity, making it easier to keep your balance. Nice. If it didn't have a limited battery life, I'd tell you to keep it on the whole time. But it does. Oh. So don't. <laughs> Okay then, well, yeah, I mean, I guess there would be some caveat to using it, but still, it sounds pretty amazing. Uh, and I guess uh, you just gotta watch your battery. Slow the rate at which stamina is drained. So I, I didn't realize there would be stuff like poison gas to worry about. Even at this stage in the game, they're introducing some different mechanics. Right, well... Again, is there a safe room nearby? Is there a private room nearby? Did anyone build one? I don't think they did. Oh, bollocks. Uh, shucks. I don't think I can build one. I don't think I've got the materials at hand. Unless this guy has any. Which he might have. Do you have any materials, dude? Okay, he's got, he's got a few materials. He's got, he's got a few. He's got a few. Uh, what do I need to build a freaking safe room? Because that would get me a lot of likes if I build one here, wouldn't it? If you think about it, that would be uh, that'd be pretty swanky. So, what do I need to build a safe house? Well, first of all, we need to choose the right place to put it down. Oh, hang on. Hang on a minute. What's going on down there? Oh, is that just Ro? Oh, I think that's Ro. What is that? Ooh, there's a lot of special alloys here that I could nab. Keep on keeping, Keep on. On, keeping on. I'm just glad it's not snowing anymore. Let's see. Is there any, uh... Any memory chips nearby? We've not found one of those in ages, but then again, I've not really been looking. Keep on keeping on. A lot of chemicals down here. What is what is that the bit? Is that that is a safe house, isn't it? Oh, so maybe I don't need to start one myself. Maybe I could just add materials to this one. I need some crystals and a lot of something. Yeah, someone's already building some. Right. Well, maybe we can help him out. That's a lot of materials it needs. Are two thousand four hundred? Like holy shit. But we'll uh, we'll see. What does it need? It needs Oh, special alloys. Well, we could grab the ones that are up there and add them to it. It won't finish it. It'll get it kind it'll get it kinda close. Like nearly halfway. We'll add some crystals though. We've got enough of those. We can we can spare those. I'll go grab the alloys. We'll add that. Do, 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 do. Oh, this is a nice area. I like, I like this. Right. Yeah, I kind of want to finish building this safe house. I, I know I don't need to. I could just carry on. Relying on my, uh, 
you know, on my canteen and stuff, but my stamina is reduced right now. I could just sleep, I guess. We've not really done that, have we? How long would that take? Do I want to be asked? I do want to build this thing, and these special alloys are just right here, so it'd be pointless for us not to add them to that thing, because I'm not going to use them anywhere else, really. We might as well. It's it's not going to take too long. Just got to be careful, because they're bloody heavy. And then I might just rest. And then see, uh... And then see what this where, where the stuff has been dropped. It sounded to me like it was gonna, a bunch of heavy stuff that we're going to have to pick up, so the power skeleton might be uh, called upon. But we'll, we'll check out the order in a second. Let's just drop these off. Uh, da, 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 da. Add those. Confirm. So that's a big chunk of those materials added. So that, I mean, hopefully someone else can finish that off in their own game. Especially if this area always has those special alloys there. Because I mean, look, we nearly got a thousand with that. So fingers crossed someone can finish that off. And I, I should get some likes for contributing. So... So, yay for me. Right. What equipment do I have on me? I seem to be carrying a lot still. Oh. Yeah, no, I need to recycle that shit. I've still got... I've still got three climbing anchors? Oh, fuck. I completely forgot. You get several. You get five in one set. Uh, that's what, oh my god, so I had more than enough. I didn't even realize that. We completely forgot about that. Right, but we can, we can drop off some. I don't think we're going to be needing quite as many of those anymore. So, we'll recycle a bunch of crap, we'll check out this new order. And, uh, and yeah. Go pick up this stuff. Welcome, Sam Porter Bridges. Welcome, Sam Porter Bridges. Let's recycle. Recycling's good for the planet. Recycle. I'll do. Uh, can I just send stuff to the private uh, locker with this menu? No. Okay. Skippity skip. Do 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 do. All right. So we've got a few more materials back there. Uh, let's put some shit in the locker. Two of those. Right. Okay. So we still have one. Still have one set. We've got a PCC. We've got two PCCs. We've got some boots. We've got our assault rifle, our blood bag. Our power gloves are kind of weak. I should probably maybe recycle those. But at the same time, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I think uh, I think we'll just leave them on, and when they break, they break. So, where do we need to go? Okay, only 63 kilograms. That ain't as heavy as I thought it would be, but it's going to be in the middle of all that toxic shit. Uh, I wonder if there's going to be BTs there. There's no time fall there, I don't think, so... Maybe we just need to get in and get out quickly before your oxygen runs out. Or your battery or whatever. From the VOG. Delivery to mountains. Okay, yeah. Let's let's give this a go. We have to, anyway. We don't have a choice. Give me that oxygen mask, my man. I don't think I need to fabricate anything, really, do I? I could make some more power gloves, but... Yeah, I'll be alright. I'll be alright. 
Uh, duh, duh, duh. Yeah, no, I think that's okay. Definitely. Oh, look, we look like a spaceman. That's cool. I'm going to just put that on my back for now. We'll put that on closer to the uh, area that we need it. And let's head out. Thank you for your contribution. Thank you for your contribution. Expand the Carol Network and cross the Tar Belt. That sounds so scary. This Tar Belt is going to be horrendous, isn't it? When we eventually get to that point. Ugh. Don't like the sound of that. Oh, this area is pretty close. Yeah. I hope it tells me when I'm going to be approaching the... Uh... Oh, that... Technically, the, the safe house is in that area. Anyway, okay. It is really close. Yeah, I should put down more signs, shouldn't I, as well? That's something I never do. Right, let's, uh, yeah, let's use this watchtower just to get a better uh, view of things before we head in. Almost there. Ooh. Oh, hang on. Is that... Are we going to have to go down into that crevice? That looks to be where all the crap's coming from. Oh god. Oh god. Looks like we will need those climbing anchors. Use the watchtower. Not that it's really going to tell me much, it's just going to show me where some things are, but... Oh god. Is it going to show me where the thing that I need is? Nothing's popping up. Mm. Oh, hang on. Ah, we did find him. Nice. Where are they? Oh, all the way down there. What a fucking surprise. Okay, oxygen mask. Where is it? Hey, that's nifty, isn't it? We look so cool. Right. Battery is going to be going down pretty, pretty fast, maybe. I don't know. Let's see, how do I get down there? How do I get down? Ooh. Someone, someone's bike's down there. I don't think you're getting that back. Right. Yeah, climbing anchor. Is that going to get us all the way down? Yeah, we should be okay. We could act. Uh, thinking maybe do a zip line to get back out, but nah, nah. We'll just uh, we'll just plunk a climbing anchor down and climb back up the hard way. So this is climbing anchor. This whoa, <laughs> this is climbing anchor. The game right now. That's perfect. We only need one. Perfect. Excellent. Dealing with toxic gas. Your consciousness gauge will be depleted. Once fully depleted, you're no longer able to move. An oxygen mask can be worn to protect you from these effects. Yeah. Yeah, luckily I have one of those. Right, let's grab this. And yoink. Uh... So I wonder what all this stuff is. Oh, wait, did someone... Oh, no, I thought someone had already... Oh, someone's put a ladder there, I guess. How many more of these do we need? Get up there. Our, our battery is going down pretty fast. Where is... Is that it? Oh, no, hang on. No, I missed one. I missed one. Cargo, recovery. All right, we got, yay. Excellent, I think we got everything we need. Cool, yes, we did. Right, we can get out of here now. Let's be real. Perfect, that wasn't too bad, was it? Again though, I like that. That's a different kind of uh, danger to deal with. 
imagine that. I'm sorry, Norman, but I don't know if anyone has the strength to do that kind of thing. That looks so tiring. Oh my god. Right. Oh yeah, look at our battery. Oh my god, release the rope. <laughs> Unequip the oxygen mask. Oh, we can breathe easy now. We're okay. Medication for veteran porter? Mm. Yeah, I'm not going to pick up any of that stuff for now. Alright. Well, that, yeah, that wasn't too bad. It helped that it was, like, right next door. Not a BT to see anywhere. That's what I like. Yeah, and then I will rest. We'll rest and try and get our stamina back. Hey. I do like this area. It's just great being out of the freaking snow. Someone's yeah, there's some more stuff I could pick up there as well. Yeah, it says free to use. Excellent. Right. We're going to be crossing the tar belt soon, though. I'm terrified. Doesn't sound like a fun place. Seems happy. That's going to get me three stars easily. Oh, a bunch of new interviews. Hartman's theory of evolution. Oh, we can now change her. <laughs> I think to Volcano Orange. Cool. Thanks for bringing in that lost shipment, Sam. And yes, it did indeed include an ammonite with a bona fide umbilical cord attached. I've already sent some images and a preliminary analysis to Hartman via the network. Interestingly, it seems the surrounding strata contain traces of tar, which lines up with one of his theories. Anyway, I, I know you only just brought this ammonite here, but I'd like you to deliver it to a colleague of mine, an Evo Devo biologist. Ah, uh, right, okay. Lately, she's taken an interest in the tar, and I think she'd be eager to examine this particular specimen. It's quite remarkable, and that's to your credit. To clarify, she has been studying how the tar may have influenced the development of various organisms. Accordingly, I would ask that you also recover the tar collectors deployed near her shelter and deliver them along with the ammonite. It would be too dangerous for her to attempt to retrieve them herself, which is why we must impose upon you. By aiding her research, we may yet inch closer to unraveling the secrets of the Death Stranding. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We've already made so much progress with the data recovered by the network. With your continued help, I know we can accomplish even more. Well, hope so. More New shit to do. Please access delivery terminal oh, yeah. for further information. So I've got to take that stuff that I just delivered to the hmm. biologist. Who is... Where exactly? Oh. I thought we were supposed to be, like, around there. It'll tell. It'll tell me. Right. Let's just let's accept it. Oh, in fact, let's send our bot on another delivery first. 
Let's do... Let's do that one. Cutting edge portable measuring devices. Back to the geologist. Deploying autonomous delivery. Okay. Oh, yeah, right. So it doesn't look too far away, but we're going to have to pick some stuff up on the way. Right. Oh, no. It's a BT area. No. It's a BT area. Shit. Bollocks. Okay. Well... We're going to do that next time, guys. Uh, this has been a fairly long video. I'm going to leave it there. We're going to accept this uh, uh, next time. Thank you for watching. Hope you're still enjoying this playthrough. I know I always say that, but it's uh, it's a long-ass playthrough. I, I don't think we're going to be done with this anytime soon, either. Uh, I'm guessing, judging by how many episodes I know there are, if, if they're all... I mean, they're probably not all the same length. Like, there are some pretty short episodes. But I'm guessing, like, we're going to be in the 60s by the time we get... Not, like, age-wise. I mean, number of videos uh, by the time we get done with this. I don't know, but I'm still going to do it. I'm still enjoying it. I want to see this through to the end. So, uh, thank you for watching, everyone. Stay safe. And bye-bye uh, for now. This is Snake telling you to subscribe to Mage Masher 22 on YouTube and Twitch. Snake out.